I must continue playing Superhero League of Hoboken. When we last left off, I was trying to work out how to dam up this river. And so, I've got an odd feeling that we might need another one of these isotopes, because normally the pawnbrokers have the answers. Unfortunately, we don't have quite enough um, to actually do this. So what we're going to do is we're going to sell a 90 count bag of power pills. We're also going to sell that, the painting, the translucent panel, the 40 count bag, and does that now get us close? We can now buy the blank isotope. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to save Twenty-two point two, because I can. Yeah, I'm yeah. weird like that. Sure. We're gonna buy this one. Done. It's a hundred percent white ice to soap. Nobody has the power yet, so let's give it to Toastbuster. Beaver jaw. Okay, we're gonna literally dam up the river. Okay, where have we seen a tree? There's forest over there, but I'm assuming there's a story event, so... Grassy area overlooking the river. Where there is, in fact, an American elm tree. Where are we then? Uh, where's beaver jaw? That's the very oddest shouting of timber. Uh, it's only maybe one tenth for the way. One tenth, eh? Oh, we can we can do better than that. Superpower of ten. Is that what you wanted? There we go. Uh, completely damming up the water flow. Water backs up on the south side. There, I guess that is what we wanted. Um. Which I guess now means we can go and grab that barrel. I would hope. There we are. Uh, Retrieves the wooden barrel from the base of the waterfall. Remains. We got the remains of a dead devil off the rim. Pronounces it to be in excellent condition. Hurrah! Um. Okay. Is this now? Army encampments, they've now kind of abandoned. Three more nasties. Um, for now we're three of these. We dropped. Smite. 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 We shall smite you all, because we can. No point in trying to confuse you, it doesn't work. Glancing blow, boom, one down. You got. Not quite enough to kill the second one. Rover Mop is down again. Apparently regenerated from that, strangely. Root rot, boom. And we already know confusion doesn't work, but yeah. Redrot. There we go. The Crimson Tape passes the extraordinarily rarefied two million experience point mark. Uh, the winner of Superhero Leagues flies in from his ultra secret headquarters along with his entire staff and a 300 piece brass band and decorates the Crimson Tape again. If this keeps up, he is going to start looking like a Christmas tree. Just a guess. Better man passes tropical oil. Huzzah, so two million point mark. Does this now mean that we get um, two hits? Resistance? Maybe. Now we have a barrel. Um, we're going to rest here because we need the crimson tape back up. Um, ok, 
Okay. What do we want to do? That must have been the elm tree going over the falls. Phew, we got out of the river bed just in time. Ooh, okay. So this is now full... Ah, oh, I think I see what's about to happen here. Oh, we still can't... Nice. Uh... This key's a... Shoot. I don't know what you actually want for this. <laughs> I was thinking of the barrel, but... Here in the open space of the former highway, the opposing armies of, um... Tonawanda and Chipanda have come together. Um, the river has begun flowing again. The armies are trapped in the islands. We now realize the futility of our endeavors. If you help us get off this island, we will repent the error of our ways. Okay. Never. I will never give up the fight. I shall return. Well, I'll be. Wait until we tell Midas about that. I'm shouting a snicker from the horizon. The cloud of dust appears. Head of buffalo stampedes down the highway, trampling the errant general. Oh, when the soldiers beat their swords and plow shores and spears into the pruning hook, uh, part of them off the island. Our soldiers gone, the party's left with plow shore and a pruning hook. Uh. That sure is a mighty fine plow share, but. But I don't think it is enough for me to give up this here key. Okay, sentimental value of the key. Pruning hook? Get in there, get... You want the barrel as well, don't you? These fine tools will sure help me bring in the crop. I suppose it's only for... Excellent! So we now have the elevator key, and now... I believe that unlocks the elevator we need. Back with a certain Dr. Entropy on top of the, um, state. Entrance. Actually, do we have enough... I'm just going to see now whether we can buy any more food from the vending machine. Yes, what's today's menu look like? Uh, we've only got 54 kilo dollars. We're quite poor, even though we've been doubly decorated as um, Hobican peoples. Um, just want to get the full exploration of this. Uh, that's probably the alternate one of the one we already had. Oh, I would get the exploration bonuses, but meh. Alright, 20 of them support. Oh, God. I hate you, peoples. Alright. Confused. Didn't kill. Alright, let's, um. Let's prioritize a bit. These two things have to die. Now that those two things have died, we can rock that one. Put you to sleep. And then we can confuse this one. Yeah, I think that was a second, um... I think that was a second little thing that we activated there. Right, so confuse. Uh, you can still just kill those, because it's just going to be easier. Which means you can attack that. Which means we might as well start shooting this. Drops. Boy, are these battles getting a bit long. Uh, put an animal to sleep. Confuse! <laughs> Tropical Aura Man's hit for a lot. Alright, let's see if we can't take down these rhinos and then the incredibly large number of things, and I know to do one. Down you albino dinos, and I see you by the back there. I have not forgotten about you. Darn. Right. Confuse him. It may well be nice, but you're not sure where the Bahamas is anymore. Boom, boom, and then just because we can, confusion. Smite! Nope, smite. Yes. 
Excellent. A3000, and we clear this area of unsavory elements. Huzzah. Is that the only place we haven't actually explored on this map? Well, I guess it's closer to, to um... There you go. Exploration bonus. I guess it's a little closer, so that's fine. Right, take that back from Buffalo. So we shall return to the superhero... No, hold on, we need to take the grey one. There we go. Up we go. It's a shame our dangerometer broke. It was quite useful. Uh, yes, we'll enter. All of our rests are restored. I believe then it is time for the final battle of Hoboken. So, to the Empire State Building. Which is down there. And not in there. So, um, yeah, Empire State Building. Fourteen nasties outside. They've prepared... Hmm, I wonder if there's going to be an enemy showcase now. And I didn't heal. <laughs> yeah, this is an enemy showcase by the look of it. Oh, well, not a worry. And nothing that's affected by trees, really. And I see you at the back. Confusion! No, he can't perform. Oh well, not a worry. Confuse. That thing dies. So does that thing. That thing nearly dies. Now I've got a feeling you're actually a plant. Yes, you are. It's only taken me this long to work out what kills it. Uh, power to confuse. Right, so we'll be able to heal after this, so... There we go. 30,700. Or maybe we won't be able to heal. Oh, God. Yeah, I figured that wasn't all of them. This is going to be horrible. I just have that sense. We actually almost killed it. I wasted that, really. Right, we're going to confuse this one. It doesn't have a brain. Rumor's almost out. If this could go sour very, very quickly. Enemies actually, yeah, they are strangely getting weaker down the list. Which I suppose is reverse of what happened last time, so... Right, let's knock out one of these. Rubermop's almost out. Oh, I did not cure that either! Oh dear, I've really not prepared for this properly, have I? Still, the rest of these should just go. Oh! Darn it, you killed Robomop! This is uncalled for. 21,000. We won our 200th combat! Captain Excitement. Captain Excitement has still asleep back at. Oh, what? No! How many more? He's getting stronger again, though. Yeah, one of every enemy, seemingly. You kill it with fire. That will start you regenerating, so hopefully you'll go away. And we're going to confuse this guy, which Let's do doesn't it. have much of a brain. Oh dear. Alright, we should be okay, but there's a couple of things on there we have to worry about, so... Rot did not work. Get back to killing things. Oh. 
missed. You can go root rot. Boom. And then you can go and try to confuse the dinosaur. You can't. Right. What we want to do then is root rot. Smash. Nope. Itch. Drops nearly. High power laser actually somehow made it stronger. Oh, we're not in good shape. This has better be the last one. Alright, so we will make sure we kill this one. Oh, we really should have dealt with you first. There you go. You're dealt with. So in theory, as long as... Actually, no. We shall confuse you. There you go. <sighs> Got it. Toastbuster passes the the iron Zaniac. Two million mark has been reached. Oh, it's over. <laughs> right. Um, rest. Eight more rests before we go back. Let's not do that again. Because <laughs> that very nearly went wrong. So now that we have the elevator key, we can actually go up here. The party, nine strong with all its paraphernalia, squeezes into the sub into what would otherwise be a comfortably large elevator. He spends key to activate the controls. Two buttons labeled lobby and 102. Press the latter. The elevator doors close. With a sudden jerk, the elevator starts upwards. Your ears buzz. The eardrums begin to feel as though they're going to burst. It's hard to believe that millions of people used to subject themselves to this experience on a regular basis. Surprisingly, a few moments later, doors open and the party staggers out. You're on the 102nd story, just beneath the famous radio antenna where King Kong clung as he met his demise. Windows ring from the room, offering views of the time-ravaged, semi-submerged city. An elevator lies open to the south. As you enter, Dr. Entropy looks up from a machine that resembles a giant movie projector. He smiles evilly as the metal bands of snap the entire party into a row of cinema-style seats. What's a movie without an audience? Of course, my projector is a projector with a difference. <laughs> Instead of merely projecting images, it can turn those images into reality. He pauses not to give the party time to absorb the dreadful possibilities this presents. for my initial test? Jurassic Park, the Blob, the Gidget Goes Hawaiian. <laughs> of course, considering our locale, only one choice is fitting. King Kong. Um, I'm just going Apologies for that. Okay. Suddenly, enormous eye appears. Friend computer! Surrounded by an even more enormous face. Surrounded by a tr one truly enormous ape. Hairy hand smashes through the window and grabs entropy. He screams as Kong drives him out to the midair, a hundred floors above the debris strewn pavement. The falling glass cuts the metal bands, releasing the party. Kong sniffs the air, sensing there may be bananas present. Um, give bananas to Kong. Okay, we're going to use a superpower on the bananas. We have superpower of ten. Feel certain there are bananas somewhere around here and begins waving his hand back and forth, trying to. Okay, we need to keep doing this. So strangely, it's um, it's the mag it's magnitude who's going to be the major hero here. So as to three thousand pounds, getting excited now. Uh, entry swinging Kong's grip does not look amused. Let's talk to him. Shut up and just get me away from this beat. Someone looked to bellow in a typhoon. Oh well. Superpower of bananas. Superpower of ten. The bananas explode back to their original size, or so magnitude assures you. Uh, they look. They just look bigger now, Tate, because we're in a composed space. This time you've learned to just take his word for it. With thirty thousand pounds of bananas lying around, well, let's just say the observation deck is getting to be a really slippery place. King Kong goes ape, so to speak. 
Finally spots the bananas and reaches in to grab them and devour begins devouring them. Hundred bunches at a time. You should peel them first, if you say Zaniac. He'll get a tummy ache. He's completely distracted by the bananas. Right. Um Giant Protector, turn off. As long as sweeps up the last of bananas, you have the just take, you take advantage of a distraction and flip off the projector. Last second icon becomes completely more and more ethereal until it disappears completely. Entropy no longer sports his plunges 1400 feet to the street below. Remember later, 15 tons of bananas lands on top of him. The resulting explosion completely atomizes the body, spreading his molecules across the tri state area. The mighty magnitude passes the extraordinarily rarefied 2 million experience. Hurrah! Boost you onto the shoulders, carrying off to a well deserved retirement. The end! Watch out for more adventures of Superhero League of Hobokan in Entropy's Revenge. You've amassed 2,343,504 experience points, which is the rank of Superhero First Class twice decorated. Yeah. Emeritus, under your leadership, Superhero League of Hobokan has achieved the status of a level 8 league. You have prevailed in 201 of 205 combats, dispatching 1,121 opponents who have completed all your current missions. We are number one Superhero League of the Northeast Conference. And that was Superhero League of Hobokan. And wow is it a good game. It really... One of the most random games I've found. As I said, I un Found it. I just randomly found this game in um, a charity shop. So, best 90 pence I've ever spent, I think. And yeah, it took a while to get working. I got it working, and awesome. It's just my level of crazy, this game, as well. It's silly, it's. But it is just. Yeah. I really enjoyed this. So, what level of craziness will I be playing in future that's going to top this? Well, I might have to look at other Legend games, but I don't recall anything else they've done, so we'll have a look. Anyway, the Shadow 2012, this is Superhero League of Hobokan. And I'll see you next time. Ah, and there isn't a second game. Oh well, until then.